was a taxi driver before I went overseas for holiday. And uh, because I injured myself, I went home to family. I didn't use my credit card in Malaysia, which is a good point. But when I came back, I want to use my card to, for taxi again. I can't use it because it has been scammed. It takes me three months to get it reversed back. And I have to do a statutory declaration. It's very inconvenient because I have no card to use. I have to wait for my new cards to come. And it's just like uh, hell, really, for me. <laughs> I've been to a supermarket using my debit card and about a month later actually I got all these transactions coming up on my bank account from America, uh, someone going to McDonald's, um, some other service stations, small transactions and I went to the bank and they, they said their card's been compromised so they had to cancel all my cards, I had to wait for like like about a week to get my new cards again. Um, finally got some of the money back, but it took, took a while. Um, and it was just really inconvenient and, and un un uncertain and unsecure sort of feeling, having your information compromised. I was at the local shopping centre. She was just um, shopping and purchasing some items. And when she got home, she noticed when she was checking her bank account that $1,400 was skimmed from her accounts. So she was quite in, quite distressed about the whole situation um, because she was so very surprised that they were able to get that much money from her account without her even knowing and with her just having her cards just on her without anyone taking it. So yeah, she was really quite distressed about that whole situation. Why am I likely to be skimmed? RFID credit card details are completely unprotected and at risk of cyber theft. How can a criminal skim my credit card? with today's technology easily. The RFID chips on credit cards store personal information. What information is stored in the RFID chip? Identity details and credit card numbers. Exactly what criminals are looking for. Using devices known as sniffers, criminals steal the information stored on RFID chips. Sniffers seek out unguarded RFID chips. It's quick, wireless and undetectable. And when your card details fall into the wrong hands? How does SkinGuard protect me? SkinGuard instantly auto-activates when it detects a nearby sniffer. On activation, the LED indicator turns red. SkinGuard is now in full protection mode, creating an electronic field. E-field, which jams and blocks the sniffer's incoming signal. The E-field is impregnable. It forms a 90 millimeter, 360 degree halo of protection. What does SkinGuard protect? All of your credit card details, your personal identity information, and the details stored on driver's licenses, passports, and utility cards. SkinGuard, guarding against the threat of electronic theft. Hello everyone, welcome to an hour of Skim Guard. I tell you, that this is an awful show to do, yet a wonderful show to do. It's awful because we're talking about skimming, something that happens to, now get this, one in every 35 people in Australia. In America, it's happening one every two seconds. It's just getting absolutely out of control. Right now in Australia, it's one of the fastest growing crimes. Identity theft. Imagine that happening. Imagine you go to your bank account and all of a sudden money that was there is not there anymore. Knowing that somebody else has not only got the information to your credit cards, but all your other bank cards and has got your address and all your other information off your, your driver's license. It is absolutely terrifying. And the chances are you probably know that it's, know someone it's happening to. You could be just out of the shops. Have a look at this. The guy that you're actually seeing here, he created this skim guard technology, okay? So he's not actually skim, but he is actually showing you the way the technology works. That is how easy it is. And the problem is we're getting into the silly season where the malls are packed, food courts are packed, towns and cities are packed, and you get so-and-sos like this that are going to just walk through food courts and shops and so forth, and they are accumulating all the information from people's cards. Are they opening their wallets? No. Are they taking their cards out? No. He can be five to ten metres away, even further, and still get all that information. Here's the crazy thing in the world, too, is it's not actually a crime to gather and share information. It's not a crime. And I'll tell you more as we go. This thing's terrifying. The thing is, though, as I said, it's a wonderful show as well. Why is that? Because we've got an answer. 
and it's a foolproof answer and it's a super affordable answer and it's the way that everybody seems to be going nowadays and we're going to be making it available to you in this hour. We're going to solve a big problem and give you peace of mind. One in every 35 Australians getting skimmed right now. Crazy. Let's get started. Let me give you details and give you some peace of mind. This is the SkimGuard Active 4-Pack with two SkimGuard Passport wallets. So to break that down for you, you're going to get four individual Skim Guards. That means four individual wallets or four individual purses are going to be 100% safe. All the cards within those wallets or purses are going to be safe as long as that wallet or purse has a Skim Guard in it. Also included are two passport wallets. Now these passport wallets do not have the cards in. In fact, they have the Skim Guard technology built in. So your passports and your cards within those passport wallets, whether they're open or closed, are totally protected. All of that for $99.95. It's amazing, huh? Hey, you've got unpart um, payments. You get the whole lot home. The whole lot for $35.53. Incredible value. And the postage and handling is under $10.49151. To tell us more, the amazing Pete Samios is here. Sir, how are you? It's great to see you. Good to see you too, Jamie. Gee, it's good to have an answer, right? Yeah, it actually is. It's amazing the amount of people that I meet now yeah. that have so many stories like we saw in the introduction. Now, Moira took that, uh, interviewing people took that video, that was very recently. That was a few months ago in the Sydney Home Show. Wow. Yeah. And, and there was just lines of people saying, yeah, yeah, I've been skimmed, I've been skimmed. I was sitting down in the State Library having a meeting yesterday on a different product with some engineers. Yeah. And the lady that was at the counter getting, ordering some coffees, mm. was having a fight with the, not a fight, but was worried with the, having a ding-dong with a <laughs> lady serving her. Yeah, yeah. Because she said, but you, I just heard my card bit twice. Because, you know, when you pay yes. tap and go? Yes. She said, can you check to see if I've been... Uh, Charged I've paid twice. Twi twice. So not only is tap and go technology vulnerable to thieves... Yeah. But there'll be plenty of viewers out there that'll have stories where they've been in a supermarket mm. and they've been charged twice just for tapping on a... Accidentally. Uh, accidentally. So if it's done, ac if it's that easy to do accidentally, yeah. imagine how easy it is to do yeah. when you put your mind to it. Hey, now, uh, I said right at the start of the show, this is one of the fastest growing crimes in yep. Australia and worldwide. One in every 35 Australians. This is happening to right now. The stats on this credit card, uh, ID fraud crime is committed, I, I said this before, in the USA, every two seconds, every two seconds, 90% of ID thefts occur when the victim's wallet is in their pocket. Your, your card does not lead to leave your wallet. You don't no. have to have it open. They can walk past and boom, just get all your information. Over 11,000 identity theft incidents are reported mm -hmm. in Victoria, Australia, every year. And the Australian Institute of Criminology reports that the average value of skimming is in excess of four grand. Yep. Gee, look how much money. Mm -hmm. Now, wh where is this, Pete? That's in Australia. This is in Australia? Yeah, that's from the uh, Bureau of Statistics. For from APCA, actually, the Australian Payments Corporation. They're the, they're the people that calculate transactions for all the banking institutions in Australia. Fraudulent transactions, nearly $2 million. Value of those transactions, over 400 But that was only 2015. It's grown exponentially now. Jeez. Wait till the new reports come out. Yeah. I've been told they're going to increase 30 to 40%. In wow. fact, you know, Jamie, that um, even the Victorian and the Western Australian Police Commissioners, yeah. they just want tap and go banned. They they're, ban sick, it. they're sick and tired of people making reports at police stations about having their money stolen. Yeah, because right. a lot of people are reporting it to police thinking they need to do that to actually get repayment from the bank. And... There's all these types of skimmers. They're everywhere. These skimmers everywhere. are everywhere. Yeah, and yeah. there's all different variations, which we'll talk about later on in the show. Yeah, right. So it's just amazing. Put them in a van. Yeah, put them in a van, in a bag. We'll show you later. Yeah, oh, that's, you know, it's scary, man. It is. Uh, it can happen with your passport too. Yeah. I want to touch on this because you get two passport wallets included yep. in this. Yep. So what do you mean? Somebody can get all Well, you know those passport. new Smartgate passports? Yeah, of course. Yeah, everyone everyone loves them. Yeah. Like we love Tap and Go, we sure. all love Smartgate yeah, yeah, because it gets us through the queues quicker. Yeah. We don't have to worry about anything. 
Now, when you go and get your original passport, yes. they want your mother's maiden name, yep. they want your birth certificate, yeah. they want your Medicare yeah, you number. You have to have so many points. They want all that. So when you go to you renew know. your passport, they don't need that, all that information. That's right. Because your date of birth hasn't changed. That's right. Your mother's maiden name hasn't changed. That's right. So all they want is your address, your updated, your updated statistics. Sure. So all that information... If you've got a SmartGate passport, yeah. is in that page in your passport that's really thick in the centre. Yeah, right. It's all okay? in there. They say here, do not stamp this page. Right. Okay? So what they mean by do not stamp this page is that this thick page has got a similar chip to the one that we find in the credit cards. Right. Now, I'm going to ask you a question now, and I don't want to get mm -hmm. this too complicated. No. These chips, you know, you're talking about mm -hmm. the tap and go pay wave things. These chips that people can walk past and just mm -hmm. skim all the information, does that mean that my cards are always wide open? Your card is vulnerable 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 52 weeks a year. So this guy walking through the mall... Yes. ..whether he's walking through a mall... Whether he's Look walking outside a nightclub at night, yeah. whether he's walking through a restaurant, he can take all your information, Jamie. There's, no and there's nothing I can do about it. Absolutely nothing can you can do unless you're protected with a skim guard. So you you, we're sitting ducks, aren't we? We are. So the price we pay for the convenience Shit, of the oh, new is technology awful. is this. So, unfortunately, we can't have our cake and eat it. Yeah. Now, people say, why won't the banks protect me? Yeah, why? Well, the banks, I don't know if the viewers realise, but every time you tap and go, it's a credit card fee, not a debit card fee. Yeah, right. So, the amount of fees that are being made are so huge, yeah. it doesn't really matter. This is the pack we're looking at. Um, th th this is... a phenomenally abundant pack for what you're paying. It's $99.95. You get it home for just over 35 bucks. I mean, it's the most affordable insurance in the world. You're going to get four individual skim guards. With yep. Skim There's guards. two skim guards in every blister pack. So you're going so to get, get four, four of these. those. They will yep. look exactly like that. They are the size and the width of a credit card and the weight of a credit card. So you don't even notice it in your wallet. No. And we're going to talk about that. Once that's in your wallet, protects everything in there, all the cards. We'll show you in a second. Same with the purse. You're going to get four of these, two in this pack, two in this pack, and you're going to get two of the passport wallets. Now, am I correct, Pete, that if I had that full of credit cards and I had one or two passports in there, whether it's opened or closed, they are protected? You're fully protected. See, that's pretty You're not vulnerable at all. So two of those, and they're super slim line, perfect size for travelling. You, can you imagine going somewhere and, and you get skimmed in another country? What a, can you imagine going through a foreign country and they pull you aside because there's a warrant out for your arrest because someone's used your information with their photograph going through another country's security and done something, yet when the real person goes through, they say, oh, come over here, please, because that's what can happen... But what the thieves really want from your passport... Yeah. ..they want that information so they can do personal loans. Right. They, can, they love getting mobile phone plans and then they sell the new mobile phone on the internet Jeez. in the pack. So it's all this that occurs with skimming. The it's thing insidious. I, the thing I hate the most is that I'm a sitting duck. And there's nothing I can do about it. That's so he just, walk, just walks past and takes all my yeah. information. You're so vulnerable and it's such an invasion of privacy. I mean, it, it's it infuriating. Is. Well, it you is. know, but what you've got to think about is it's a database. It, like you said in the opening, it's not illegal to collect the information. It's just illegal to use it illegally. Yeah, right. So think about skimming. Gee. If someone got caught with a skimmer... Yeah. Right? Yeah. Which, how are they going to get caught? But if someone got caught with a skimmer... Yeah. ..they haven't broken any law. Yeah, right. Because they haven't done anything with They're the just information. information. They're just oh collecting it. Oh, my gosh. It's so wrong. It's so messed up. Like we said, in the US, it happens every two seconds. In Australia now, it's one in every 35 Australians that's yeah. getting skimmed. Fastest growing crime in Australia, they're saying at the moment. Um, OK, I want to talk about how this is going to protect me. Yeah. It'll protect everything in my wallet, yes? Everything. 
everything in my now, wallet just <clears> by putting one card in, peace of mind, done. Okay, now what I've done here, yeah. if we have a look in here, there's a skim guard. Right. Okay? I haven't seen you do this before. No, I know. I just thought, how are we going to show the viewers how many cards are protected? Right. If we fill this jar up with credit cards... Yep. That's how many we can protect at once. Are you serious? So I don't think there's anyone in Australia with a wallet or a purse... Yeah. ..that's thicker than this jar. So... So it, it creates... Like a dozen cards in there, 20 cards. You could hold, like, 40. It's like a force field around Yeah. So how Sorry does it work? But... How does it work, right? Yeah. So what the skim guard does, it creates an instant halo of protection. And the beautiful thing about skim guard, and a lot of viewers can't get it through their mind how this works... Yeah. ..no batteries. No batteries <clears> at no, all? No batteries. No maintenance? You know, because if you add batteries in anything and they go flat, yeah, you're, you're, you're gone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, probably the first time you know your battery's flat... ..is when you get skimmed. You get skimmed. <laughs> yeah, that's right. OK, so, no so how does it work? So what I've done in the skim guard, um, we've created a narrow on the skim guard... Yep. ..and I'm going to put it over here on the FPOS machine... Right. ..right, so that we can have a look. And I don't know if we can pick that up... I'll just put that over there. Yeah. Can we see the red light with all these lights Just here? where the arrow is. It's very fast. There, we ah, see it there now. It we is. see it now. Yeah, yeah. So we red see light. that red light. The arrow. Yeah, I can see so that. So now we, what's happened now, because we come, we've come near an electronic device, this is a friendly device. Right. Although most people would say they're not that friendly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So this is a friendly device that's going to communicate. But this over here is a not-so-friendly device like this thing here. This is a real sniffer, Jamie. Oh, Imagine if I had that in my pocket yeah. and I was walking down the road. This one's going to take information from three to four metres. Just walking past people, Just walking gathering past all that information. People. And they can sell it and do so it. So what happens is that when the... There's an antenna in the skim guard. I don't want to get too technical. Yeah. But when the skimmer comes within the skimming distance of your purse or your wallet... Yeah, because it's in your wallet, yeah. The skim guard's antenna sucks the power from the sniffer... Yeah. ..and activates itself instantly. And what happens is the skim guard's patented technology... It's a world patent... If you have a look at the IP Australia, you'll see my name registered as the patent holder. Yeah. Has an amplifier in here. So whatever the skimmer's power is, mm. it amplifies it exponentially to create this wonderful halo of protection around the car. Therefore protecting everything within your wallet or your or handbag your or your purse, whatever it is. Yeah. It protects it all. Protects it all. It doesn't matter how many cards are no. in there. So we often get That's calls awesome. from viewers saying... Will it damage my credit card? Yeah, cards? great question. No. What happens when the skimmer goes away, it goes back to sleep because it has no power. So when you want to use a credit card, you can take it out of your purse or your wallet and use it. It won't affect your credit card in any way. Great. So you can rest assured, viewers, that having the skim guard in your purse or your wallet anywhere in your purse and your wallet is going to protect you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And as Jamie said, yeah. quite rightly, we're coming into s silly season. Oh, man, it's going to be rampant. It's you going know. to be absolutely rampant. Hey, um, just got to remind you of the deal again. Uh, you're going to get four of these. They're incredibly affordable. This is one of these things, like, the deal is so good because we want people to have them. Um, isn't it a five-year warranty, Pete? And well, but really, they'll last. last forever, but last we forever. limit it to five years yeah, for wear right. and tear. You're going to get four cards in there. You're going to get uh, two of the passport wallets. That's going to look after one family, two, maybe three families, depending on the size of yours, maybe more. Amazing value, 49151, and that's your peace of mind. You're done. You're not a sitting duck anymore. you fixed the problem. Uh, 3553, that's what you get the whole pack home for incredible value. Hey, the phone lines are only going to get busier. The hour is only get busier. We've got a lot more coming. Um, so be quick. I want to show you a little video right now. I'll be back in a second. Have a look.
Keep your hard-earned money safe with SkimCard Active. Credit card skimming is the fastest growing crime worldwide. We all know someone who's been skimmed. Don't be the next victim. The majority of credit card fraud happens when the card is still on the victim. You can be skimmed when your wallet or purse is still in your bag, in your pocket, and you wouldn't know until it's too late. Scanning devices are easy to access and allow criminals to steal credit card details and personal ID from a distance. Busy commuter areas like airports, train stations, bus stops, crowded shopping centres and food courts are some of their favourite places. Be aware you could be skimmed anywhere at any time unless you have the protection of Skim Guard Active. Now protecting your card and identity details is easy. Just slide Skim Guard Active into your purse, wallet or pocket to get 24-7 protection. Its super slimline design needs no batteries. Skim Guard Active gives you total peace of mind. It creates a blocking shield of up to 90 millimeters around your cards, protecting them from skimming devices. You can even see when it activates. Don't risk your day, your trip or your life being ruined by finding out your cards have been maxed out by thieves or your identity stolen. It can take years to clear your credit history. This is a global crime wave of unprecedented proportions. So it's not a matter of if, but when it could happen to you. Don't be a victim. Get Skim Card Active. Guaranteed 24-7 credit card and identity protection. I love that. A guaranteed 24-7 credit card and identity protection. One in every 35 Australians again skimmed right now. Uh, over 11,000 just in Victoria mm. last year. It's crazy. You're a sitting duck without this. Your credit cards, your Wait. information cards are wide open. Wide open. Wait till the new figures come out. Yeah, right. So this can solve it all. Yep. Skim card. So okay. let's show yeah. the viewers how yeah, it yeah, works. Yeah. And then I want to talk about mobile phone banking. Okay. Can you protect that too? We're going to show the viewers the vulnerability of mobile phone banking and how to protect it. Yeah, great. All right, so cards first. First of all, we all go in yep. and the lights come up. I'll just, just do that paying. again. Yeah, good. Right? That's paying for something, right? Yep. So once we've got the skim guard there, nothing happens. If we take the skim guard away, wow. it's working. Okay? Amazing. So the skim guard is your protection. This is your insurance at less than a cent a day that's going to protect not only your money in your credit that is locked in your credit card, it's also going to protect your personal identity. It's going to protect your name, your address. It's going to protect all that information that would give a thief access to go and get a mobile phone plan Maybe go and get an unsecured personal loan for a few thousand dollars and you don't want anyone knocking on your door because you don't have a skim guard in your wallet. Now, what I want to do, Jamie, mm. is talk about mobile phones. Right. Now, these days, a lot of banks are offering the fact that you can actually place your credit card on the mobile phone. Yeah. Okay? Yeah, sure. Which means that when you go to tap and go, you can just tap Use and phone, go yeah. your phone. Absolutely, sure. So how convenient is that? Mm, it's great. I mean, life. first of all, it becomes a computer. Now it becomes a credit card. Mm. The same vulnerability occurs. So the reason we've got this four-pack for tonight's viewers is that for those viewers that do, unfortunately, have banking on their phone yeah they should take one of the two skim guards in the pack yep and pop it in the back of the phone inside their case okay right because what that will do that'll protect your nfc chip in your phone the drawback and there's only one thing you've got to think about viewers when you want to do that transaction for the banking you've got to take your phone out of your case to do it, right. obviously, because the... And not only will it protect the information on your credit card that's stored on your phone... Yeah. If you've got personal details, like passwords, anything like that, you may have nobody, some family photos... He, nobody stores passwords on their phone. No? <laughs> Carry on. Yeah. <laughs> so... The skim guard's going to protect all that as well. So for the viewers that have already got skim guard at home, yeah, if you've got banking on your phone now, you need it. You need it. Yeah, that's it, hundred percent. 
Gee, that's amazing, isn't it? I mean, it's, 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 it's scary. Absolute, it is absolutely terrifying. Can I have a question that just came in? Thank you sure. for your questions. Producer at tvsn.com.au. Um, uh, somebody was saying they quite often, if they're going out at night, they'll just take their credit card with That's them. That's right. Could I throw the skim guard in my pocket just sure. with the credit card? What I would do, yeah. make sure it's in the same pocket or put a rubber band around it. And then it's totally safe. And then you're totally safe. The same with the ladies' handbags. If you've got a big tote bag... Place all your credit cards in one section with a yeah. skim guard. And then you're set. And then you're set. And you're totally set and safe. forget. You never have to think about skimming again. And the other question just came in again there about then if I want to pull this out and use it, this doesn't affect this, does it? No. It doesn't render no. it useless or anything. No. Take it, you know. No, not at all. All you've got to do functionality is away, no. the functionality of your credit card works 100% of the time when it's not near the skim guard. Yeah, great. The functionality of your credit card never works next when, it's, when it's next to the skim guard. So nobody can touch it. I want to know if this is 100% guaranteed. 100% guaranteed. Yeah, they cannot get through You know, we've been selling skim guard for two years. I just showed you a magazine where in the UK we launched yes, it on day you're one. you're number one. And on the first day they sold 55,000. Jeez. And the reason it's foolproof, Jamie... Yeah. ..no batteries... Yeah, that's it. No batteries at all. No upkeep. Uh, there's nothing you need to do to it at no. all to keep it working. Skim Guard's painted RFID technology. So it detects the skimming devices used to steal credit card details and personal information. So it detects them, right? And then when it detects a skimming device or a sniffer, a Skim Guard immediately <coughs> draws power from that device and switches on, switches to active mode. And That's then if, right. if you see it, you'll actually see the light come on. And in active mode, the skim guard creates an impenetrable 360-degree E-field around everything within that wallet or purse, making it absolutely 100% impossible for a sniffer to access or steal information. Without it, you're a sitting duck. One in 35 Australians right now are getting skimmed. 49151 is your item number. Remember, it's a pack of four cards. So if you've only got two in your family, great. This will do somebody else as well. Or, or if you've got four in your family, think about your teenagers. If they go in the pub or something like that, you know Absolutely. what I mean? They've got to have this in a wallet or a purse. 99.95, and that includes two passport wallets. And you can have a couple of passports in each if you fancy, and you can put credit cards in them. 35.53, you get at home for the most affordable insurance you'll ever get. Problem solved. No more worries done. Hey, um, we've got another special guest coming up in this show, and we really wanted to bring him on. Yep. Um, and he's a man, security expert, who's put this to the test. That's right. He's coming up straight after this. Have a look at this little video. We'll be back in just a couple of seconds. We were away with another couple travelling through Europe. I'd picked up on SkimGuard before we left, and it proved itself when our friends had their cards skimmed and maxed out, and we didn't. While the bank tried to sort it out, we helped them financially, which was fine, but really embarrassing and inconvenient for them. Skim Guard really works. I just wanted to let others know. I've had two friends talk about being skimmed and I didn't want to go through all that hassle and worry. My work has me traveling constantly and in all the kilometers I've done over the last 10 months, no problem at all. Skim Guard means peace of mind. The convenience of tap and go is great, but I worry about how easy it is to be scanned by crims. With this skim guard card in my purse, I just feel protected. I work too hard for my money and I don't want anyone else to get their hands on it. With credit card skimming and identity theft rife, we all need protection. Don't let the crims have it easy. Block their skimmers with the RFID pod. Slimline in design, it offers 360-degree RFID and NFC blocking security. There are six individual credit card sleeves, a multi-card pouch, and a zip-type compartment to house your cash or extra cards. The RFID pod is the Slimline secure way to take your cards with you safely in your purse, bag, or pocket. Will you stay vulnerable to skimmers and risk having your money and identity stolen, or will you take a stand and protect yourself? It's a decision made easy with the multi-card security of the RFID pod. Keep your hard-earned money safe with SkimCard Active. Credit card skimming is the fastest growing crime worldwide 
We all know someone who's been skimmed. Don't be the next victim. The majority of credit card fraud happens when the card is still on the victim. You can be skimmed when your wallet or purse is still in your bag, in your pocket, and you wouldn't know until it's too late. Scanning devices are easy to access and allow criminals to steal credit card details and personal ID from a distance. Busy commuter areas like airports, train stations, bus stops, crowded shopping centres and food courts are some of their favourite places. Be aware you could be skimmed anywhere at any time unless you have the protection of Skim Guard Active. Now protecting your card and identity details is easy. Just slide Skim Guard Active into your purse, wallet or pocket to get 24-7 protection. Its super slimline design needs no batteries. Skim Guard Active gives you total peace of mind. It creates a blocking shield of up to 90 millimeters around your cards, protecting them from skimming devices. You can even see when it activates. Don't risk your day, your trip or your life being ruined by finding out your cards have been maxed out by thieves or your identity stolen. It can take years to clear your credit history. This is a global crime wave of unprecedented proportions. So it's not a matter of if, but when it could happen to you. Don't be a victim. Get Skim Card Active. Guaranteed 24-7 credit card and identity protection. Hey, the phone lines are really, really busy at the moment, everyone. So if there's a little bit of a wait, just, just bear with us. We'll be with you as soon as we can. Our operators are here just above our studio, so it's all in-house, and they'll be able to answer all your questions. Hey, um, Michael Casey has just joined us in the studio. I want to give you a really quickly just touch on a couple of uh, his details. I know there's a heck of a lot there. Uh, he is a security specialist, consulted high-risk security facilities during, uh, including defence, prisons, state and federal police and airline specialist in high security, portable document and weapon safes, introduced their first mass hands-free phone technology to Australia. This guy knows his stuff. Introduced the first mass used do-it-yourself breathalyzer to Australia there too and so, so much more. Uh, and right now he has been testing the skim guard. Now, this was handed over to him by Peter Samios, who we were just speaking to, to put through its paces to see how good it is and plus to research how much of a rampant crime skimming actually is. So, ladies and gentlemen, Michael Casey's with us. Good to see Hello, you, my Jamie. friend. How are you? How are you? Hey, um, can we start with this? Um, is it as bad as Pete says it is? Unfortunately, it's worse than Pete says. I think you've underestimated how bad the, the problem is. Um, I heard you talking about it a little bit earlier. Is it worse? But it's worse than that because nobody's yet able to quantify the damage that's going to happen long term to people whose identities have been taken and what people are going to do with them in the future. What do you mean? What do so you... once your identity has been taken, there's another you existing. And the things that people are doing, the crimes they're going to commit against you and you're going to be held responsible for them because they've taken your identity when they've skimmed you. Wow. Uh, okay, how can we spot a skimmer? Sometimes you can't. They're in plain sight in front of you. You cannot tell Well, at you all. can't tell. It would be... It's not like the old guy wearing a ski mask holding up a bank. You Correct. don't see it. Right. So we can show you a couple of examples. For example, just down here on the desk, yeah. we have a selection that you can just purchase on the internet. These are now, skimmers. These are all skimmers. Mm, some gosh. of them are pre-made, some of them are kits. So you say purchasing on the internet. We're talking about amateurs, guys Absolutely. that are just ordering things, Absolutely. putting them together, walking through them all. And then if you have wow. a look at this one, for example, in the pack, you may be able to see there's a gold section, which is the antenna. Yeah, yeah great. Now, we all can understand as things get bigger, they get stronger. So yeah. if you grow the antenna from the size of that yeah. to something just over here that we have on display on the other side of the counter is a backpack. Right. Now, the backpack is a bit bigger. Sure. Your range so has increased. More power. In yeah. more power, your laptop sitting in there with that antenna, five metre approximately radius. With the backpack on top? With the backpack. Five metre radius. So that's radius. like you've seen on the video clip, someone walking yeah, yeah, along yeah. and uh, everything around him five metres. Five metres, so that's five big steps. That's Absolutely. A, that's a heck of a radius. And then you go up to a suitcase, which is a little bit bigger. Quite innocent looking, in plain sight in front of you, in the airport, the bus terminal, mm. anywhere, would you suspect that suitcase. See, here's the problem. If you don't get a skim guard tonight, you're going to be going shopping in the next couple of days. You're going to be in a mall and anyone who's standing within five metres of you, you're going to be nervous. You're going to be, what, what, are, you doing? what are you doing? Why is this person near me? What's it? But are it they get, skimming my stuff? It gets worse than that. 
Now, there are apps available free yeah. for mobile phones. Really? Now, as you can see, the gentleman there, he's walking along. He's yeah. the, the developer of these technologies. He's yeah. just skimming to show how it operates. Yeah. But that can be done with a mobile phone, and the app is free. That's crazy. And now, who doesn't have a mobile phone standing around next to You got me terrified got. now, man. Um, look at this, like with a mobile phone, one metre, isn't it? Yeah, there we about go. About a metre. And then out five metres. It grows up to about five with a backpack. Ten. They put them in, in vans? Yeah, they found them overseas with um, vehicles, with the whole side of the vehicle as a big antenna. Yeah. And it's about 20 metres each side of that vehicle. So that's going down the street. Every car, footpath, people having coffee, into the shops. It, it has the reach. And they can just drive down the street and take all those da data off. From someone's off. house? A absolutely. You were saying... No, I was saying before. Is it one in every 35 Australians? Or, that or was last think... year's figures. Oh, well, OK, so I'm wrong. The newer figures haven't come out yet, but when they do, you'll find it's way, way higher. OK, now, dealing with the skim guard here, what about as technology advances and, and the skimmers get more sophisticated and, and their machines get more powerful? Will that still solve the problem? Yes, look, in our testing, what we've found is that there's other ways that things can be skimmed and can be beaten. So yeah. we wanted to see, can you beat a skim guard? Yeah. And we weren't able to. Um, what happens is the only way that people could try to beat it was to get a stronger scanner or skimmer. Yeah. Well, the way the clever technology we found inside the skim guard, it has a booster or an amplifier. Yeah. So as the signal gets stronger that's coming to skim, it just stronger. boosts it up anyway and sends it back out stronger. So it, it, it could, we couldn't beat it. We tried everything. Couldn't beat could. it. How did you test it? How did you test Look, it? there's a lot of scientific and technical testing, but yeah. that doesn't mean anything. The most you important thing is we tested it in a number of different ways and it works every time. We, it didn't fail. So there are a couple of different tests. We do heat tests where it's put... Uh, through into an oven on yeah. the dashboard of a car and left there all day in the sun. You know yeah, how right. a yeah, dashboard practical. gets because yeah, yeah, things course. melt and warp. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, one of the other things that we did test, which we can show folks down here, is we put it into water. Yeah, so this so can get one totally wet. Sitting in water and bent in half. And then we also bend them. So and, and that's still fully functional. That's still fully functional, which we can show you. We've got a. A card over here, yep. which you were showing earlier, which has gone green on the so that works. Yeah, yeah, detector, yeah. And even the bent one put next to it, it turns it red. It's working. So that still works. Totally Absolutely. wet, bent in half. Absolutely. The technology works. It's kind of full. Oh, I mean, it's foolproof. It's it's foolproof. We haven't been able to to beat it. Okay. How does this compare to other? I mean. Are there other ways of, of protecting your cards on the market? I mean, you must have tried everything. How does this? compared to other ways of sure. stopping the skimming business. Okay. What we need to do is just show you how the skimmer works and then I can show you how it, um, other technologies don't work. Yeah, yeah, work. yeah. That'd be good. So is that all right? what we have here is an Everyone? FPOS. Yeah. And an FPOS machine is able to read a credit card. Sure. So can a scanner. Right. Done. An FPOS machine cannot read a driver's licence. Of course. But a scanner can. Okay. An FPOS machine can't read a bus pass. Right. But a, but a scanner can. Right. An FPOS can't read your hotel room key card, mm. but the scanner can. The scanner can so read your... So the scanner can read all sorts of things. The scanner can read your passport. That's a lot An of information. An FPOS machine can't. Yeah. A scanner can read it. And that'll can go read it. Green. So this... There we go. Gone green. So a scanner is not an FPOS machine, it's something a little bit different. But it now, scans everything. It scans everything. Now, people have tried with different technologies over time and it's evolved and we, what we've called the skim guide is a fifth generation. So if we go back to the first generation, people used to try to wrap their cards up in L-foil. Oh, yeah, yeah. Tin foil and stuff them in their wallet and yeah. it was great, wrapping every single card. Yeah, it's Very right. practical. Yeah, great. And then it got to yeah, the, the shields, which were made of um, like an aluminium type foil. Yeah, right. Which you'd okay. slide one card into each. Yeah, right. You have to put a card into each one. That's right. Then they yeah, progressed right. to um, another type of technology, yeah. which is these metal cases. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And you might have seen these around, right, and you put a few cards in. But then you can't use your wallet. You've got to use this metal case. That's right. right. Now, the, these are all called Faraday cages, basically, where they are encircling yeah. the product 
and protecting inwards. Whatever's inside that is safe. Is safe. Got it. But the scanners can see straight through those now. That can technology is, really? is obsolete, basically. And once you would open something like that, yeah. the second you open it, you're scared. Yeah. It takes the, the information. You're no longer protected. Yeah, right. So then along has come yeah. um, all sorts of, of wallets and yeah. products that are supposed to protect you. But let's have a quick look. You know, when this goes green, it sees something. Yeah. So there's a wallet that's supposed to be protected. She, not working. Not there's another close. one. Not working. So the only thing that you've tried that works 100% every time, seven, every time is skim a skim guard. And that skim guard is amazing. It doesn't have a battery and it just works every time. So there's nothing to fail on it. So Gee. it's an electronic defence against an electronic enemy. And the look, old days were physical defences yeah. against electronic enemies. Size of a credit card and you shove it in your wallet. That's it. That is it. Hey, um, Michael, there's probably people out there, we'll just finish on this now, I know you're a busy man. Um, probably people out there watching right now that are thinking, not going to happen to me. What would you say to people that are just, I'm immune, yeah. Well, I might be a sitting duck, but I... You might be a, a, person, a betting person, but <laughs> you're, you're going to lose on this one. If you haven't been skimmed, the chances are in the very near future, you, you very well may be. Yeah. You may have been skimmed, but you just don't know it yet because it hasn't shown up and you haven't had that call, that horrible call. Yeah, right. So it's, the statistics show that it's increasing. Yeah. Um, and it's a really, really big problem. So yeah, right. It, the only thing that I've found and tested, and I've been looking at these technologies for 15 years, yeah. long before it's become the problem it is today. Yeah, yeah, right. And this is the only product we've tested that, does that hasn't failed any test we've ever put it Yeah, through. huge, huge, huge. I mean, it's huge worldwide now. It just launched in the UK. What, 50,000 sold in the first day. Michael, thank you for your time. Thank, thank you so much. Uh, like I said incorrectly before that it was one in every 35 Australians that are getting skimped uh, right now, and it's more. It's more. That was last year's. That was last year's. Yeah, so it's a lot more now. And this, you heard it from the horse's mouth, this is the only way to go. That's the only way that you're going to 100% protect that information in your wallet or your purse 24-7. No batteries required. This thing just works, works, works. Now you've got peace of mind. Now you know you're safe. Your information, your identification, everything about you is safe now that you've got a skim guard. In your wallet, in your purse. If you go out tomorrow and think, nah, I'm not going to bother. It's going to be in the back of your mind thinking, what's this person close to me for? What about that person who walked past me? What if I lose a few grand before Christmas when it really hits hard? $99.95 gets you the whole pack together. Four skim guards for you, your family, maybe it's extended family, whatever, and two of your passport wallets. Phenomenal deal, really. $99.95 and you get the whole pack home for $35.53. Brilliant. $491. Five, one. Speak to our operators, 132310. They're the loveliest people in the world. You've got a money-back guarantee until the 25th of Jan, by the way. We've been, you know, doing this for uh, coming up 21 years here at TVSN. Uh, 132310 is the number. Here's another clip for you. Be back in just two seconds. So my mum was doing some shopping and her credit card actually got skimmed and they got almost $6,000. This was just so distressing, not only on her behalf, but all the family, because you hear of this happening. But you don't think that it's happening here and now and that it can happen to us. There's not only that, the fact that they couldn't pinpoint exactly where the skimming took place. So you're a little bit paranoid about what shops to visit or, or where to go when you've got your credit card on you. And then there's the hassle, the fact that it took mum almost two weeks to get new cards reissued and she didn't get that money back for almost three months, which is a long time you know, when you're talking about that amount of money. So after this, I did a little bit of research and I came across SkimGuard. Um, it fits straight into your wallet with your other credit cards. It's the size of a credit card. And it just gives you that peace of mind, the fact that you don't have to worry about anyone getting your details or skimming your credit card again. I'd been holidaying in Cairns and went to use my credit card to find out it had been declined. I had been skimmed. Um, it ruined the holiday and it took weeks to get a new card and months to get the money reimbursed to me. I since found out about SkimGuard, which I just keep in my purse with my other credit cards and I feel much more safe and reassured that this won't happen again.
Here's a shocking fact. The new Passport Sea chips make it quicker to clear customs, but they also make it easier for thieves to steal the identity information stored in them. If you don't protect your passport when you travel, you're at risk. The personal information detailed in your passport application is stored in the e-chip and may be accessed without you even knowing. And those private details are all that's needed to hijack your identity for a multitude of possible frauds against you. Airports, train stations, bus stops, crowded tourist zones and shopping centers are where identity thieves love to operate. If you're unprotected, you could be their next victim and you wouldn't know about it until it was too late. Travel smart. Get the protection you need from the RFID passport holder. It creates a scanner blocking shield around everything you place inside. Its slimline, well-organized design gives you space for your passport, travel documents, cash and cards. If you get scanned on your next trip, it won't just spoil your holiday. Identity theft causes months, if not years, of hassle and stress. Get the RFID passport holder. Guaranteed passport and card protection. You're going to receive two of those. Two of those are passport wallets and four skim guards. Each skim guard, when it's in a wallet or a purse, will protect everything within there. So you don't need more than one. And you don't need skim guards in the passport wallets. They've already got the technology built in. Now, each of these two packs... Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention this. Look, normally when we do these shows, uh, it's $49.95 for a two-pack. Two-pack, yeah. That's right. So what are you getting? Two of those, which is 100 bucks. And effectively, well, you get in the passport wallets for nothing then. Yep. Absolutely. Two of them. Yep. Which are valued at 40 bucks. Oh, yeah, mm -hmm. it's a really good saving. And honestly, man, last time I was taking a flight, people have passports hanging out of pockets. I know. It's all over the place, It's man. funny, isn't it? Oh, crazy. It's funny what they... It's funny they don't understand the risk. Yeah. Hey, you know, Jamie, the one thing I want to touch on with the viewers at home, and I'd really like a few phone calls at the office if this ever does happen to you... Mm. Um, we all go and tap and go. Yeah, sure. Right? I did it today. When's yep. the last time, viewers, someone behind a counter at a supermarket, a restaurant or a bottle or somewhere like that ask you for your personal identity, a photo of you, nah. to see that the name on the card matched the name like the physical face in front oh, of you? Oh, no. Has it ever happened to you no, with Tap and I, Go? I tap and go for a few hundred bucks something today. No. Yeah. No way. So, no way it hasn't happened for ages. Now, the reason I ask that, because I'd really like a phone... I've never had a phone call yet where someone says, yeah, I go to this place and they always ask me for identification. See, what happens, Jamie, what the thieves do, they make credit cards. You can get a credit card made anywhere in the world for about... 10 cents. Right. So all they do is they emboss it with a few numbers, put a name on it. Sure. And then what they do is they take the information from their computer that's just been taken from your real credit card and clone the chip in the false that's credit card. Wow. And then what they do is they simply start tapping going. That's it, because nobody but checks. But the person ID. behind the counter is not checking this. Oh, of course. To see that that name on there looks like this face <laughs> on here. Yeah. That don't happen. No, that's I not. I haven't seen it happen. No, you don't. And guess what? With Christmas coming, it's going to happen a lot, lot more. And um, we noticed before in those stats, they're saying around about four grand. Um, because it's amounts very often, it might even be less than that. You don't notice straight away. And it's no. Like, I had another thousand bucks in there. I thought I had another five hundred bucks there. Well, what the skimmers really do is they do a test run, and that's yeah. why the value of transactions is always like four hundred and twelve ah. million, nearly two million transactions. They'll do a test run on a They'll small amount. They'll do a amount. test run. Ah. So when we get the new figures, these are the figures till June two thousand and fifteen. But when we get the new figures, they're going to blow out. Yeah, Don't right. worry about that because skimming has now become a pandemic. Yeah, right. Right? Yeah, yeah. More Last year it was an probably. epidemic. This year it's a pandemic. Yeah. So you can figure yourself the figures are going to go up. Hey, can, can I just grab a wallet over there for a sure. second, Pete? I, I just want to show everyone. Take this. any of these. Yeah, yeah. These are all uh, what we call RFID wallets that I've bought. Yeah, and, and still... No, go. They still don't work. Have you ever been overseas and you've ever you know, tried to use your credit card and it didn't work. Or you've lost your card 
it's a panic. I remember, I remember traveling and I actually lost my passport. You just freak out. You're trying to come take the embassy and all sorts of stuff. It's, and what, yeah, the inconvenience. You actually go into panic mode. You do? It's just like losing a passport. Would you go into panic mode if you, lose, if you lost your passport? You'll definitely go into panic mode if your passport skim because yeah. there's maybe more than one guy because when one guy skims your passport or your credit card, he's going to email all that information. So not only is he going to make the money from it, yeah. he's going to make money from on selling that information yeah, yeah, right. to other guys in different countries around the world. It's crazy. Do you know what you said just so makes sense too when they, they test it out? You know, they take a couple hundred bucks here, yeah. come a few hundred bucks, and then just keep going and it builds up. And what they do is they test it at, in a location where the banks would think, yeah, well, you no, know, if fair. it's a supermarket, yeah. it might be buying something small. Then what they'll do... They'll go and buy a new plasma TV. They'll go and buy yeah, something. Right. Yeah, yeah. They'll always keep it under three or four thousand dollars because they know that most credit cards yeah. have a limit. Yeah, right. So they can figure out wow. what the limits are on your card. So when they get your information, they know what card it is because it's on their deciphered en encryption. Yeah. And what they do then is. They Google that bank and tells you what the limit is so they know how much they... They know how to stretch the rubber band yeah, wow. without breaking it. Do you know, Scotty, our producer, um, he was actually saying, he noticed this, he's cancelled the card now. He, it, it took him ages to notice, but his um, card was getting skimmed, like small, small amount, like yeah. a buck here, buck here, yeah. buck here. Ongoing, ongoing, and it, and it was an account somewhere in, like, Africa or somewhere yeah. around, on the other side of the world, and it was over a period of four Years and they just kept on boom, 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 and, boom. And guess what? You know that number's getting a few dollars here and there. Yeah. What about the personal information? What were they well, doing with it. that over there? And that's the really scary thing. What? Hey, just quick question. So I can put my skim guard anywhere in the wallet at all? Anywhere. And that protects all the cards that's right, over here? Because remember... Oh, yeah, that's right. That's the halo protects. of protection. Yeah. How many that cards much. can you fit in there? That's how many all cards right. the skim guard's going to protect. Now, Jamie, the one other thing I really wanted awesome. to mention... Yeah. There, there's a big trend now of phone cases where people get a mobile phone mm. and even if they don't have banking on their phone, which is one thing I would never suggest to anyone without a skim guard in their phone... Yeah. ..is they put their credit cards inside the case... Yeah. ..with the mobile phone. Have yeah. you noticed that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, for people sure. have two or yeah, three cards. it's more convenient. It's, I get that. It's yeah. convenient. So sure. instead of carrying a wallet, they've got that. All in one hit, yeah. So if there's any viewer who's got a phone case out there and puts their credit cards in the phone case, in the sleeves that these phone cases are now made for, you need a skin guard in there because that information is as vulnerable sitting in your mobile phone case as it is sitting in a wallet or a purse. Wow. Uh, you're a sitting duck without this, and I hate to say it because I know it sounds so, so strong, but the facts are the facts. One in every 35 Australians are getting skimmed right now, and, and that was last year's stats. Like uh, Michael Case, you joined us, the, the security specialist. It's a lot worse now, and it's getting worse. You can solve it. You can solve it with a skim guard. You're done, you're dusted, problem solved, you've got peace of mind. Maybe it's for you, your loved ones, your, your sons and daughters, whatever it is, your problem is over. Remember, these don't require a battery, there's no upkeep. They've got a five-year warranty, but that's just kind of there. They're built to last you forever. They can get bent, they can get wet, and they will still keep on working. Honestly, how much is your identity worth? How much is the hassle worth? I bet if it happened, to one of us, we think, I would, in a second, I would pay, it works out to be, what, $20 for a card? One cent a day. One cent a day. Look, it works out to be 20 bucks for one of these cards if you break it all down, because you go, well, I'm four, and that, that. Yeah, less. Um, you'd say, I would pay that in a second if I could go back in time a few weeks and stick one of these jolly things in my wallet. There's your answer. And, and as Michael Casey said before, our security specialist who tested these out, he tried every other method, and he said, that's the way to go. That's the, only, that's the only thing that's full prop, foolproof. Hey, um, the operators are standing by to take your call. They, they always are. We're open 24-7. Uh, the phone lines are still kind of busy, but um, it's worth the wait. You can go straight through 
online. If you want to give it as a gift too, great way to go. You always get your money back guarantee at the moment. Money back guarantee until the 25th of Jan. What a pack. And the two passport wallets for your traveling, whether it's domestic or international, they're worth their weight in gold. Uh, 49151 is the item number. Get a moment for just over 35 bucks. Thank you, Ben. Thanks, Jamie. So good to see you. A wonderful yep. but awful show. That's awful it. Awful but wonderful. That's it. Thank you so much for joining us. Have a great night. Bye. Bye. brings you his A-list celebrity style direct from Hollywood. Step out with his red carpet fashion accessories like the star you know you are. Get ready to dazzle with Charlie Lapson. Win a five-night stay for two at the incredible Pinnacles Resort. Situated at beautiful Airlie Beach, gateway to the Great Barrier Reef and Whitsunday Islands. Purchase any item from the TVSN Christmas catalogue between October 25 and November 30 and you'll automatically go into the draw. Each order equals one entry, so the more you shop, the better your chances to win. Share the luxury and magic this Christmas with TVSN. In today's modern world, our feet are put under tremendous stress that our bodies can't handle. With MBT's Curved Soles, we're forced to maintain our natural balance and posture, stimulating and exercising the body's supportive muscle system, resulting in numerous pro-body benefits. The simple movement of the MBT may help relieve joint and muscle pain, and even tone the buttocks and thighs. Feel your whole body in motion with MBT, movement through instability. Well, we know when Seven Sisters is in the house, we are going to have a big day when it comes to the, to the Today's special offer. Today is fun, it's flirty, it's perfect for this time of the year, and it's full of vibrant prints and colour. Now, I have lots of options for you in this floaty style, suave summer print long line drape mesh tunic, but we can do better than that price because it is Seven Sisters, it is TVSN, and it is Today's special offer. So we're going down to $129. That's $40 saved for you and you've got two part payments now my color options for you we start with that beautiful vibrant blue that you see on screen we move to the black and white the orange uh, the what we're calling it Paris and floral so there's lots of color but what I love about this tunic for summer is it's got stretch so it moves with us through our day it's got this lovely lightweight mesh now normally when I hear the word mesh I think okay that's gonna be scratchy it's not gonna feel good on the body this is so so soft and when we talk about seven sisters we know this fantastic unique printing process they start with this white base of material and then they print over the top so you get vibrancy you get color you get decadence now miss Renee is looking absolutely fabulous and that's in the beautiful blue so you've got lemons playing through there you've got a blue that comes down through the back in that lovely point to give you a nice little cinch in at the waist then you have just this really nice float over the tushy float over the areas that we may want to camouflage but it's very very feminine now you can belt this up you can tuck it in like I've done as well because it's really nice and lightweight and you can see tucked in that gives you a longer line at the front and then you've got a little length at the back um, now I've got the black and white on the one you're seeing right here is the gorgeous floral and uh, oh it's like peony that's coming up a little bit later you've got a bouquet of flowers and then this really fabulous stripy background as well so I'm thinking beaches I'm thinking vacation I'm thinking beach to bar this is just that perfect throw on wear it over the swimmers as well because it has nice coverage but just a slight transparency so if you have that yacht 
and you're cruising along, then pop that on. These are the other colours for you. So that's the Renee in the blue. You've got the orange here, which has a fantastic leopard print all the way through. And uh, then you have your Paris, your Paris. And you can see that's a beautiful streetscape scene of uh, Paris. So all you have to do is choose your pattern. Um, Size-wise, I've got small, medium, large and extra large, but they're very, very versatile. Throw them on over the bathers, put them back with jeans. First part payment is $66.70. Thank you.